In these severe situations, paramedics are forced to rush to the hospital. Even though the patient's health is on the front of their mind, this isn't always reflected in the way they're treated in the back of the ambulance. The days of driving top-of-the-line sports cars to school have somewhat disappeared. Now students are more than willing to drive older cars to save a few bucks. Bill only steps away from old Hancher. Some fear the new auditorium is a recipe for flooding disaster. But the new Hancher auditorium will be built seven to eight feet higher than the previous building. With this year's better yield, the price of corn has fell dramatically. But this drop in prices doesn't have all farmers down in the dirt. There's no question that Twitter has grown to be more than just a place to connect with your friends, but instead provides a valuable resource for many professionals. But then the real question becomes, are students learning all of these social media skills here in the classroom? It's not just the beautiful weather. It's not just the vendors. It's the entire atmosphere that keep people coming back to Uptown Bills. Construction crews have been working very quickly to meet their 2016 deadline, but that progress came to a screeching halt when crews discovered artifacts lie just below the surface. In Iowa alone, nearly half a million dollars are given out each year in food stamps. But unlike traditional paper forms of food stamps, the new ones come in a debit card. Whether it's the simple things like enjoying some TV or spending some time here on the playground, the Ronald McDonald House has an activity for all children. But the real story comes from the families that pass through the house. In today's visual culture, a few keys, a click, and a post can alter your life in a matter of seconds. But that isn't stopping many young people from pushing the limits. In a violent situation, evacuating the building is often the first reaction. But please say this isn't always the best choice. Let's time it and see how long it takes to get out of the building. <laughs> From the third floor, it took me nearly two minutes to get out of the building. During that trip, I could again be exposed to the shooter or cause confusion for police officers. But little has been done to keep pedestrians safe outside the vehicle. That is until 2014, when all new cars will be required to have rear view backup cameras inside them. So now drivers can see everything that's behind them. It was only a few short weeks ago at Hawkeye Courts, they could find tenants roaming the halls and sitting on the lawn here on nice days. Now looking around, the halls are blank, and there's no answers. So with enrollment increasing at the University of Iowa, it raises the question, why is the time to evict tenants now? That there is such a heavy emphasis on success in this society because of there's no jobs, and so everyone feels that they need to be on the maximum level in every aspect of their life.